Ari Ari. Yes, my sisters and brothers, uh, we are here on Zanzibar Island and we're here in the famous Stone Town. And we're we're going to show you later on why it's really Stone Town. You're going to see stone all over the place, everything built solid stone. And right now we're at the market and we're just going to give you a nice little walking tour of the market and let's connect you with a whole lot of energy. Okay. We got my sister Niali here, enjoying the journey. Right. Yeah. We got I'm the rest of our group here. the journey of a lifetime. The journey of a lifetime, family. From Ghana now to Tanzania. Right. We just got some money exchange right here. So I always recommend big bring big bills, 50s and 100s, because once you go to the, the Forex borough, you show up with some 10s, 20s, they're gonna give you a lower rate. So we always recommend that. Just go to the bank and have them just drop you some big bills. And then once you come, convert the money and spend local currency. Don't try to negotiate a bargain with US dollars. So these are the things that we have you know, to share. That way you can be prepared for your journey of a lifetime when you're ready to make that move. And for those um, who have any issues and things with walking, we all got different options uh, for you, but we do do some walking at times. And this is our tour guide, okay, Safe. come close. Thank you. Okay, so now let's give you short general information in history of Zanzibar. So Zanzibar is a two big island combined. First one is Unguja, second is Pemba. That's all called Zanzibar. So the general population of the people 1.3 million to both islands. So Zanzibar is Arabic name means Zanzibar, just the land plus people. So Zanzibar first is colonized by the Persian from Iran around 11 up to 14th century. While around 14th century to 17th century, Zanzibar was colonized by the Portuguese. I hope you remember famous explorer like the Vasco da Gama. Once as a human species in India, around 1488. So around 18th century, Zanzibar was colonized by the Sultan of Oman. So during that time, the first Sultan of Oman was Saidi Said. So Saidi Said was a Sultan in Zanzibar around 1804 up to 56. He was chief to step it up to Zanzibar around 1840. So during that time, Zanzibar was the capital. So around 1890, Zanzibar was under British protectorate because the Sultan of the Sea of the German in Tanganyika, so far and before the Sultanate. So, once a big protection. So, around 10th of December, 1953, the British provided the tenure of the last sultan. So, during that time, the last sultan we got Saidi Jemshi. So, Jemshi was a sultan in Zanzibar around 1963. Once around 1964, we have the Russian here. That's why Jemshi exiled in Zanzibar and go to the UK. So the same year, around 1964, was the union between Zanzibar and the Tanganyika. That's why we formed Tanzania. So that means Tanganyika, Zanzibar, near means together. So in short, the Zanzibar is a partner part of Tanzania. That's why the union system is in Zanzibar. And the place where we walk now, we call Stone Town. So Stone Town is World Heritage Site, just conservation by UNESCO, and special tools for the only. So special tools for the only. So here we call Stone Town because most of the house material is just stone, limestone, the music plate, that's what we call Town. And the front of here, I hope you see the level of top. So this is our central market. We call Sultan Market, we call Estella Market, our local name is called Gala Gianni Market. So our central market was created by British around 1904, so after the open and the day And the special is open early in the morning and it closed in once after sunset. So it is a big market for partition, like a fish market, with a beef market, with the fruit and the vegetable market, even with a spice market. I hope you are interested, you want to see all partition. All of them you are free to see maybe fish, spice, fruit and the vegetable. Are you ready right now? It's okay? Yes. We are, we are ready right now. For yes. You. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
What was that about? Oh. Yeah, they want to sell and he said inside is much better. Yeah. Yes, family. All this food in Africa, herbs and spices and all kind of stuff. Yes, family. Yes, man, that's my brother, yes, my brother, the reggae, the reggae fever, the reggae fever, and yes, family, in the market, walking to the market, that's our guide up there, are you doing this, family, you have to stay together, or are you moving around the market, you know what I mean? Yes, yes, yes. Enjoying a beautiful walking tour to the market. What is that? Zanzibar. What is it? It's a map of Zanzibar. A map? Yeah. Oh. Okay. Zanzibar. Okay. In the mall. Exactly. In the mall is from Zanzibar. This one is in the festival. What is it? I'm sorry. We have to go back to the city. We brought us here. Yeah. Hello? Not me. What is this? What is this? What is this? What is this? You said it's a cinnamon or vanilla? Yeah. Is this nutty? Oh, no, not me. Can I agree with the spice from yesterday? Is this for wasala? Alright, so these are some of the spices our family. Uh, we went to the spice farm yesterday and so uh, masala. Uh, masala flow so masala for rice. Different foods that made the different yeah. spices. And now uh, these are some of the spices. Flow masala for rice. It's actually been packaged and uh, organized so you can come in this and get what you want. Hello, yes, sir. Madam, this is a supporter. I'm good. This is the best kind of food. We have the spices for the gift. Dance, bado, butter, fried, Africa, starfish, flour, spit, that's nine. You know how much from this and this? All this are there. Five thousand for what? How for you? Yes, sir. 
I'll only tell you once you're done recording. Absolutely. Alright, so family, we are going to continue out uh, through this market. But right now, we just uh, here at the, the location where you have just nothing but spices. If you look around, you'll see spices over here, over there. So, what you're looking at, this is literally the spice session. The tea. <laughs> and if you want to know more in deep details about how these spices and what trees and everything is connected to, you guys will see our video on the day on our arrival on Zanzibar Island because we literally did a beautiful, beautiful spice tour. Didn't you love that Niali, the spice tour? Doesn't, doesn't it like really connect you to what's going on here? Yes. Because we saw the trees, now we see the package. Yes. And I like how they have the small bottles of the concentrate. So I know if I cook anything with this, it's going to be so rich and so, I know everything for the smell good. I love it. It's I mean, you're a spice woman yourself, right? You, yes. You, 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 you be working your herbs and spices. Yes. Yeah, this serious. smells so good. I don't just want to eat it right now. Be loud masala for rice. Mm hmm Have you used that before? No, I haven't. But these these are the things that we saw at the uh, spice farm, like the cinnamon, the cardamom, the black pepper, the garlic cloves, and sanchar. Kaka, what's sanchar? Ah, this is a kind of mix. A mix? You know, I mean this. A spice? Uh -huh. Sanchar? Yeah. What is Sanchar? Sanchar uh, here we don't have, but we, we have on the spice farm. That's why we call it the pilau with the spice mix. Oh, oh my God, it smells so good. All right. We're going to come back this way? Oh, absolutely. But okay. get what you can get. Um, while you can get it. Okay. What is, how much is this? I said I was going to eat raw the whole time I was here. That's good. Uh, which is...